in my channel I just put on my wig so I'm gonna go ahead and draw my eyebrows off camera and I'll be right back to continue this makeup look okay I just went in with my Ferrari concealer and just set my eyelid I'm going to go into damp sponge to just blend my eyes I'm going to go in with this eyeshadow and take this this really cute pink shade right here this shade I'm going with a flat brush to take this shade called Akati from my GIF cosmetic eyeshadow palette and use it to highlight my brow bone taking my smaller blending brush I'm gonna go in with this shade called Malachi Mal Malinche this shade called Malinche and I'm just gonna use that to sort of give this pink shade I've added a dimension, a movement, a force. I'm gonna go in with that same big blending brush and just blend that all the harsh lines and try to you know make it seamless. I'm gonna go in with this shade called Tozy. It's like a purple shade. I'm going to mix this Tozy with the black and by the way the black is called Sitlati Sitlati I'm going to mix both shades and just add more definition to my eyes Going in with that blending, shade, blending brush I use earlier on i'll just blend everything like just go all over it going in with this soft pink shade called nenet or whatever i'm very sorry i'm not really good at the pronunciation of these names and just use this to give me an illusion of like a cut crease when nothing is going on there Making sure to bring that to my tear dot area. Taking my eyeliner to draw me some wings. I'm going to take my black pencil and just line my waterline. I'm just going to take that red shade I used to just smoke my eyes. I'm going to take my Maybelline foundation. I use just one pump and that's all more right but wash it as in I'm going with my Ferrari C concealer and I'm taking the white shade my magic I'm getting me Watch me do my magic. Reverse contour 
so before i go in and set my highlighted area i just go in and powder contour my face and i'm using this decay palette i'm taking the two darkest shades to you know contour my nose and my face Blending those highlighted areas because I'm about to set them in both. You guys already know the combination of this powder, so that's what I'm using. One of the reasons why I love using a wedge to you know set my highlighted area is because I can get a precise line like this. Like can you see that? So I'm taking my um, Anastasia Beverly Hills look. I'm taking this two shade to highlight my face. Yeah. And I'm going to take my brow pencil and just line my lip and get them ready, you know. And mind you, I'm overlining my lip. Taking this Huda Beauty lipstick and you know just put that on my lips. Spice up. I'm using this Beyonce Secret Lip Gloss. I'm just gonna dust off all the excess powder from my face and just you know press it in as I dust it out. For my nose highlight, I'm going to take a precise. I'm going to take this small brush because I want my nose highlight to be pretty precise. So that's what I'm going to do. Placing these two blush together for my decal palette, and you know, just give me some good blush. And I'm gonna take in this shade called Chestnut. This shade here yeah, called Chestnut. I'm gonna use this to blend my entire face. Since I'm not using the lashes, I'm taking my time to, you know, pick my lashes very well so they can be a bit pronounced in this look. So yes, this is it for my makeup tutorial guys and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, follow me on my social media platform. They're going to be done in the description bar. I love you more, but God loves you most.